all the top stars are back for the big occasion and we're about to get things underway. Kickoff not too far away and to take you through all the action tonight. Cameron Smith, Paul Vorton and it's a very good evening. Feet of a Thank you very much, James. The cauldron is at boiling point. Finals football is here. The Broncos and the Storm, a clash that has us all salivating. A fixture dominated by Melbourne in recent times. But is this the occasion where Brisbane will turn things around and make a charge to the grand final? Well, the Melbourne Storm coming out. They last tasted premiership success in 2020. This club is used to the pressure cooker of finals football. They expect to be on the biggest stage. Leads the Broncos onto Suncorp Stadium. Let's listen to the atmosphere at Suncorp. Final series. And don't we have a good one to get things underway tonight. The Broncos and the Storm. And a month-long roller coaster ride starts now. Enjoy your journey on the home of NRL Finals Footy 9's Wide World of Sports. Tui Kamakamitha hit hard. Jordan Ricky in the tackle for Brisbane. Adam Reynolds there as well. Yakin. Taken by Carrigan and Haas. Still inside their own 20, Melbourne. And there's a little bit of to and fro between Carrigan and Grant. Oh. Two Origin teammates. Oh. Anyway, he, he seems to be quite cool these days. He's mellowed a bit. Farnworth. Brisbane being camped down Melbourne's end of the field in the opening minutes. Can they turn this pressure into points? Walters tries his luck down the short side. Then back to the centre of the ground. Haas. Ten away from the line. Walters goes short to Carrigan. Carrigan wrapped up. Hero in the tackle along with Grant. Reynolds. Walsh on the bounce. Late offload. Farnworth. Just get off. Herbie will play it. 12 away from the line. Flegler. Reynolds. Reynolds, lovely pass. Stags beats one, beats two, beats three, four of them, and opens a scoring. Katoni Stags with a beauty. Yeah, what a set play that was by the Broncos. Lovely use of the football as well, particularly in these conditions. The, the football's got to be quite greasy. Harvey Norman replay. Well, that's Tommy Flegler right in the middle there. But just that little, sh little show from Adam Reynolds with Jordan Ricky dropping off underneath, just held up the defence. And what they're aiming for there, it was to get Katoni Staggs one-on-one with young Tonema Paya. And Katoni Staggs, this is the situations he loves. Just watch there, right foot step, beats his man, bend into Cameron Munster's chest, too strong. Yeah, outstanding play. He beat four of them there. Adam Reynolds, oh, swings back beautifully. That's a beautiful ball. Munster got on the outside of his man. Now Xavier Coates for the corner. He's in. There's a try to Melbourne. Coates is in in the corner and the Storm hit back. And that's just pure power by Xavier Coates. They're going to have a look at it. Go okay, coming in to tackle five. The Melbourne Storm players are Grab confident a no try. that he's got there. We review the ground whether it shifts as he puts it down. I think he might have that. lost it. Adam Reynolds coming is there. Five. Billy Walters comes in, Farnworth there. All good, great defence by the Broncos, again. That was scrambling defence, it's something that's been a big part of their game Nelson, this year, but Nelson. that play, it was created by the charge from Wait Nelson, the Sofa Solomon, who's just oh. come on the field. First half, it's been Carrigan, it's been Flegler, Harry it's been Haas. Now the Storm oh. have got their own big man. Palacia, tight bound in 2024. Another one of the many Broncos in their first finals appearance. Tonight is a kick from inside the 40 by Billy Walters. What's the bounce going to do? Pappenhausen, he got there, set up nicely for him. Big 
Defense too on Pappenhausen. Coates. Tackled on his own 30. Hughes. Jerome Hughes. Hughes, one of the store players in the lineup tonight. It was part of their last premiership in 2020. That man, Ryan Pappenhausen, one of them. The others, Cameron Munster, Christian Wells, and Sofa Solomona. Good take by Wells. Under pressure. Actually, just on that Melbourne 2020 premiership side. Some small stinging defence. Six still inside the squad. Nine at other clubs. There's one, Suliasi Vinavalu, who's with the Wallabies. And another bloke, Paul, who's sitting with us as Brisbane get a penalty. How good is September football? Finals football. We expected a lot tonight. Arriving here at Suncorp Stadium. It hasn't let us down. Brisbane up 8 0. We can all take a breath. So much to talk about at half time. Wow, 8-0, Brisbane in front of the storm. Danica down to you. And they've come away with 12 wins. Stay Finals back. though, a little bit different. Second 40 is underway. And Brisbane, through Keenan Pulisier, gets us started for the second half. Carrigan, strong in the opening 40. Rising to the occasion. Hetherington oh, standing in the tackle of Munster. Playing the ball. Carrigan, his second hit up in this opening set. But Lockie, you got some news for us. Yeah, Ryan Pappenhausen back on the bench. They must have made that change at half time. Tonal Appear came on late in, in that first half. Ryan Pappenhausen went to the, the left edge. The, uh, made the change at half time. He's now on the bench. Meany takes that well. I'm sure we will see Pappenhausen again. Carrigan. Man. Capewell. Christian Wells back on the field from Melbourne. Sims in that tackle. Brisbane. Again, heading inside. Melbourne's 20 metre zone. A try here, and they go beyond two converted try lead. Farnworth pressing into that pass. Arthur's, it's play on. And touched by a Storm player. Set restart here for Brisbane. Hetherington. If it had a roof, it'll be blowing off if Brisbane can score here. The crowd, they're bang for blood. Reynolds to Walsh. 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 Walsh into the crowd. Yeah, Reese Walsh over the line. Yeah, Reese Walsh. We have not seen a lot of him tonight. But he's injected himself here. The crowd's gone bananas. It's the Harvey Norman replay. Just keep your eyes on that man with the ball. Shimmy, a dummy, and he had the strength to get the ball over the line. Yeah, it's another great play. What about the footwork from this man and the vision? It was young Ton Mapea running out, charging out of the defensive line to try and come and cut the ball off. But Walsh, he had the presence of mind. And there's the conversion of Adam Reynolds. There, there wasn't a lot in that, was there? No, there wasn't no. a lot as far as contact goes, but the way the referee described it, it was late. So, today's standard, that's late. Hetherington now for Brisbane on the back of that penalty. And what an opportunity it is for the Broncos to extend their lead. Capewell. Now Smoothie to Reynolds, Walsh again, this time passes Ricky! Jordan Ricky! The Broncos are in dreamland! Doesn't it? Harvey Norman replay again, out to the right-hand side. This time Reese Walsh, he just pulls his run up a little bit. No jamming defence. Oh, 
affairs for this one. Brian Atkins. Yeah. I don't know, Chai. Can we check with three? Just make sure it gets to the line. I don't see it get to the line at the end. It might do. Well, I, think, I think we did see the ball yes. in the end goal at the end. We've just got to see how the ball gets there, whether there's a second motion. I think everything's cleared up to that point. Jordan Ricky running a Clear lovely all aspects of play up into this point. He ducks the head. I think he gets there. It's a try. The ball's on the line. Yeah, there's a, there's a fraction of that ball on the line. That's all it takes. Jordan Ricky's right arm always remains up. It's on at this point yeah. here, it touches the line. We have a decision. And there it is. Makes it a 20-point lead. They've still got seven and a half minutes to go. Well, they've got some defending to do now. As play continues after that lengthy stoppage. Pierre with a juggle. Set restart. Press center six for Brisbane. Bam. Haas. Payne Haas offloads. Flegler. Hetherington. He'll play it eight away from the line. Flegler. Reynolds. Lovely ball. Cobo. Dives over in the corner. And Brisbane are off to a grand final qualifier. A yeah, little bit of icing on the cake. Lovely stuff. And we've had some wonderful players tonight, but none better than. The king of finals, Adam Reynolds. He's the organiser, the Harvey Norman replay. And look at that for a pass. That's a semi-final pass. And Cobo waltzes in to wrap it up. Now yeah, we've seen that play before this year, haven't we? With that lob pass over the top. Reese Walsh has opted to go for that play a couple of times as well, particularly down this right hand side to Cobo. But they've just, they've run rings around that left-hand side defence for the Melbourne Storm. When they've jammed, they've been able to find space back on the inside. Reynolds from touch. And off the upright. No goal. Oh, got it. Got it. Went over. Got it. What a kick. Absolutely. And, you know, they're down on troops. They've lost a couple tonight. A couple of outside backs in particular. And he's just going to have to turn them around, get them home to Melbourne, review this quite quickly, and then move on with the next game plan. Oh, no, here we go. Innocent. It's Reynolds. Does he have the pace? Here they come. Reynolds testing out the hamstring. Oh, I reckon he dropped it. it. Oh, did he? He's looking straight up at the big screen. He's, he's dropped it. <laughs> Coming into one. The poor fella, the little trotter. So no he just couldn't get there. Recheck touchline. Look at him. What are they? The little trotters. The trotters. He's running on empty, and he reaches out to score, oh. and he's dropped No it. try. Yes, this is devastating news for Ryan Pappenhausen. We have had confirmation from the Melbourne Storm medical team that he has broken his ankle, uh, but we are hearing early reports that it was a compound fracture as well, which is just devastating considering his run with injuries of late. It is horrible, horrible news. Yeah, it is Danica, and important to point out as well that he's just handled himself so well, Kevin Walters. No, he's been terrific. He's had a great year coaching. He's still the Kev that we all know and love. He just lay back, nothing seems to phase him. Down to the last four seconds. Last play of the game. Ricky. Kicks it into the crowd. Brisbane have broken the hoodoo. They've beaten the Melbourne Storm. And they're 80 minutes away from a grand final appearance. The Broncos are back as a force in September. Full time at Suncorp Stadium. The Broncos have defeated the Storm.
26 points to nil.